Modern day, Talladega, Alabama. A quiet, southern, historic town, just minutes east of Birmingham. Quiet, except for this. One of the world's fastest racetracks, where the rubber meets the road at speeds of up to 200 miles per hour twice a year. And Talladega is also home to one of the country's largest and most experienced industrial rubber manufacturing companies, Cineflex Rubber. Cineflex Rubber Products was founded in 1958 and began manufacturing rubber products for the timber industry. Originally housed in a single building, Cineflex has steadily grown into a major manufacturing complex. Over the past 50 years, we've drastically expanded our product capabilities within our eight divisions, serving both national and international markets for over 4,200 customers in all 50 states and eight countries. Cineflex is the dominant force in the custom rubber manufacturing industry and now provides custom industrial rubber products to more than 70% of the nation's industrial rubber and gasket distributors. Quality, fast turnaround, impeccable customer service, and flexibility are the four cornerstones of Cineflex that have earned us the reputation as the go-to source for any rubber needs in the custom rubber industry. Let's take a closer look at how our processes and capabilities will work for you by walking you through the process of creating what is commonly known as a J-seal. J-seals are used frequently in hydroelectric dam gate seal applications. The process of manufacturing a part of this caliber allows you to see almost all of the vital areas associated with the custom rubber manufacturing process. First, a lab technician must develop what is commonly referred to as the rubber recipe to meet the desired physical requirements of the part to be manufactured. This batch making is first done on a small scale in the lab environment, or about 800 grams. There are hundreds of ingredients that can be combined in thousands of different ways to produce the desired rubber compound characteristics. Specific combinations will develop the desired qualities, such as resistance to outside elements, compression set, tensile strength, and elongation. When the technician has perfected the recipe, it's then replicated in much larger quantities on production open mills in 50 to 250 pound batches, depending upon the necessary pounds of rubber compound needed in the manufacturing process. The specific measurement by weight of each recipe additive and its equal distribution throughout the batch in the milling process is critical to the performance of the end product. After a thorough mixing of all the recipe ingredients on the production mill, the batch is sheeted off to cool and test samples are taken to the lab to make sure that the rubber is fully compliant with the desired physical qualities. Once the physical qualities have been confirmed, the rubber batch is released for production purposes. Production-ready rubber batches are placed in the extrusion area for conversion into what is commonly known as mold prep rubber. First, the rubber is rewarmed on an open mill to ensure that it will take the appropriate extruded shape. Temperature is always a critical element in the extrusion process. So while the rubber is being warmed on the mill, Technicians will install the die for the appropriate shape into the key and make sure that it is warm through the application of external heat from flame. Once all materials and components are at optimal temperatures, the rubber is then sheeted off into smaller strips that will be fed into the rubber extruder. As the rubber exits the extruder in prep form, it is immersed in a bath to slightly cool in order for this rudimentary shape to be retained prior to the vulcanization process that will occur while being molded. During the extrusion process, quality is maintained through the continuous periodic measurement of the extrusion. This will ensure the most uniform parts at the end of the production process. Once the mold prep stage of production has been achieved, the material is then transferred to a press operator that cuts the material into specified lengths and weight. Once the material has been placed in the preheated cavity mold, it is then placed under heat and pressure for a specified amount of time. The combination of heat, pressure, and time are vital to the successful vulcanization of a conforming custom rubber part. These combinations also ensure that any cross-sectional variances in the part are eliminated, thus creating unparalleled uniformity throughout. After the part has baked for the appropriate amount of time, it is removed from the mold allowed to cool, 
and then inspected for conformity. Once the vulcanization from the molding process has occurred, the rubber elements have now bonded into their permanent form. After the part has cooled and passed the quality control process, it is then ready for the joining of the parts through a process called splicing. The parts to be joined together are first measured and then marked to be cut at the appropriate 90 or 45 degree angle. These lengths are critical to ensure that the spliced parts when joined equal the exact final dimensions of the required J-seal. Once the extruded, molded, and vulcanized parts have been cut to ensure proper fit, the ends to be joined have a bonding agent applied. An additional unvulcanized rubber piece is then cut to shape and placed between the two ends that have been prepped. The two ends with the bonding agent and unvulcanized rubber piece are then fit securely into a smaller cross-sectional mold to take the new rubber piece through the same vulcanization process, combining heat, pressure, and time that was applied earlier in the process. Depending on the size of the J-seal, this process can be performed several times and at different angles before a final dimension part is achieved. Once the final dimension part has been achieved, it is inspected for quality and has any excess rubber fringe removed, commonly known as flashing. The part is now ready to be sent to the shipping department for one final quality inspection before it makes its way to the end customer. So whether we're manufacturing large gate seals for hydroelectric dams or producing small gaskets for industrial pump applications, we approach each job with professional creativity and a commitment to quality and service. Give us a call to arrange a tour of our facilities and to discuss how Cineflex can help take you and your vendors to the next level with the nation's largest and most experienced industrial rubber manufacturing team. Also visit our website at Cineflex.com to learn more about our services and how they can be tailored to the perfect fit just for you and your products. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, YouTube, and Facebook for news and videos to help keep you informed about new and exciting news and products Cineflex has to offer.